The Delta State Government is activating the restorative justice system as enacted in the Administration of Criminal Justice Law 2022. This was revealed by the Attorney General and Commissioner of Justice, Delta State, Ekeme Jero Ovovo Riole, at a one-day stakeholder summit and capacity building for restorative justice held in Asaba, the state capital. Our Asaba correspondent, Akwame Jero Friday, reports that the Attorney General and Commission of Justice in Delta State, while explaining the importance of the restorative system, noted that activating the framework is in line with the state government's goal of ensuring a more equitable and effective justice delivery. The government is a humane one and we are not interested in just punishing people. So whenever we have the opportunity, we intend to rehabilitate offenders in a way that you know, both the offenders and the victims have a sense that you know, their voices have been heard. The whole idea is that we don't want to congest the prisons or consular centers with you know, human beings that can be outside and be more you know, productive. To themselves and to it's a very welcome uh, development because uh, worlds, uh, countries all over the world are moving towards restorative justice and I think this capacity program has been well organized, having all the necessary stakeholders on the ground that will be essential towards the implementation of restorative justice in Delta State. This training is very beneficial to everybody that is here because this has to do with uh, restorative justice. It's a new trend in adjudicating on criminal uh, offenses or crimes, as it were, uh, rather than taking somebody through the, 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 the trial process, all those lengthy trial process, you can use restorative justice program. And when people subject themselves to that restorative justice program, the case can even end with a common, I'm sorry, and the matter goes. So this, 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 this form of, uh, this program actually, uh, it helps everybody. It helps the offender, it helps the victim, and it helps the community. Uh, I will need a lot of time to talk about the many benefits that come from restorative justice. Now, restorative justice, like you've heard all morning, it brings about, you know, restoring relationships, settlement of disputes, cohesion in society. The opposite of that is just chaos under development. So what we're trying to do, we're trying to bring people together, repair relationships, settle disputes among people in the other state. That's a summary of what we're trying to do here. And again, you know, what everybody knows is the usual courtroom process. Go to court, uh, we meet in court, we challenge people in court. Courtroom processes, they tend to bring about pain. 